Hi, and welcome back. My name is Aaron, and you're watching Three Tails RV. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install these bug covers so that they don't fall off at highway speeds. The in the video that I just had, you saw me put these springs in. The problem is, when you're driving down the road, that could just fall off. And then it'll be laying on the side of the road and then you gotta buy a new one. So today we're gonna take these springs and we're gonna throw them away. And I'm gonna show you how to install these bug covers the simple and easy way so that they won't come off. If this is your first time here, we'd love to have you subscribe and become a member of our Gardens community. Hi there, I am Jason with Imagine Your Odyssey, and you're watching Three Tails RV. Come on over and check us out. Our link will be down in the description below. Now here's Aaron with today's video. Recently, one of my viewers asked me, Aaron, those little sp spring things that come with the packet for this, will those actually stay on your RV when you're going down the road? And that got me thinking, how is a better way to do this? And in today's video, we're gonna show you a better way to install the screen covers for your furnace and your water heater. And the items you're gonna need for this are a nine inch pair of wire twists, and you're also gonna need some mechanical or safety wire. We'll have affiliate links for those items in the description below. All right, so we're just gonna run one through, we're gonna run a six inch piece of wire through this top notch. Do like a J, pull it through. Put a couple twists in it to kind of lock it into place. And then we're gonna do one on each side of this bracket. So let me finish that up and I'll get right back to you. Now that we got that done, let's put these wires, get them as close as possible to each other. So, Next, we're gonna take, put this over that, run the wire right into the wire mesh here. Just like that. We'll just put a twist in it, pull them back together. We're gonna to take the safety wire. We're gonna take it right here at the end. I'm going to put pressure on that. Lock it into place like so. We're gonna turn this knob to make sure that it's set. And we're just gonna spin the safety wire. Just like this. We're gonna get it tight. We don't want to over tighten it because it'll break. Like so. And we're gonna repeat that with all of the other three. There you go. We're just gonna crimp it down. Cut off until it's about a half inch. Space next to it. That way it doesn't snag on anything. before you could pull on it and it would come off now it's pretty much rock solid if you want to see another rv related topic check out this video right here until next time remember live simple live free and enjoy the ride and we'll see you on our next video